Hey everybody, how you doing today? Good to see you, each and every one of you today. Well, guess what today is? Nope. Nope. Today's Black Friday. That's right. Black Friday. And we're having a great day today because I've been out shopping. Bought a pair of socks, a pair of blue jeans, and I bought some... Up what? Yeah, I know. I'm telling them right now what it is. Today being Black Friday. Oh, oh, yeah. Not only did I get blue jeans and some other stuff, but today is also Record Store Day. Yes! You know Beetle Brad was out on Record Store Day. <laughs> I started my day at 6 a.m. this morning because when I went in April for Record Store Day, it went seriously around the building and down the street to almost to another building where it started to turn to go down the street. And there must have been, I have no idea, just hundreds of people in line for Record Store Day. It was absolutely mobbed. They had a live band in the parking lot. One of the radio stations was there. And even the TV station came by. So I figured I better get in line early, early, early. So I arrived. No band. I got there right at seven o'clock. Boom. I walked, I'm, I'm walking in line at seven o'clock. Beetle Brad is in line. I am the seventh person in line. <laughs> yeah, we got all the numbers. Seventh person in line and there's no band, no radio station, no TV station. And there was hardly any line of people at all. It was just crazy. There was hardly anybody there. Um, and they didn't open the doors till 9 o'clock. Not 8.59. Not 9 o'clock. But like 5 after 9 o'clock. So, alright, now that I've rambled, let me show you what I got. The first one was a 45 for Record Store Day. And it is The Birds. Really cool. Show you the back. And yes, Beetle Brad, there's the songs. Beetle Brad loves the birds as well, believe it or not. And then the other thing, come on now, those of you who watch, watch my channel, you know what Beetle Brad likes. Here's the insert. Beetle Brad absolutely loves, 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 come on, say it now, colored vinyl. Yes, you are correct. <laughs> and I was so, so bloody excited to get it on blue vinyl, too. Isn't that rocking? That's just so cool, blue vinyl. All right, really happy to get that. And then next up is this album by Petula Clark. I couldn't think of what it was. No, Petula Clark, just kidding. I do love Petula Clark. She is fantastic. And there's four songs on this. This one kind of made it an, an EP. And Beetle Brad is going to do something fun. Got me a knife. Let's open it. I have not seen any of these. So when I'm opening something, we get to see it together. Because a lot of you who didn't get to make Record Store Day or a lot of you that don't have it in your country or your town in America, I kind of get a chance to share it with you. So for those of you who couldn't make it to Record Store Day, I'm so sorry. I really am. That's too bad, because it is, it is fun. No download card. Come on now, come on. <laughs> We're taking it back. We're taking it back. Sorry, I'm in a silly mood. I've been up since five, so leave me alone. <laughs> no, actually, I got up at six. There we go, there's the vinyl. For me, that's early. Yeah. For Beetle Brad, that's early. I am just not a morning person. If it's 9 o'clock, eh, then I'm a morning person. No, I mean, I'm usually an, an 8 o'clock riser. Okay, this is the reason... Boy, this is flimsy. This is the reason why I stood in line forever. Was to get these records that I'm about to show you. 
if I can open them. Wow, these are so flimsy, the uh, sleeves. I'm trying not to cut the sleeves. Um, did that do it? Eh, hey, talks amongst yourselves. Yeah, watch that be my my uh, screen thing is my head down. Sorry, this is taking so long. This is this is really really hard to open. But this is the reason why I went to, like I said, why I went to Record Store Day is to get this. And it is Paul McCartney. And this is with Paul McCartney. Sorry about the glare. It's because of the plastic. The Record Store Day is with Jimmy Fallon. So this was a special edition for Record Store Day. Like I said, and there's the record store sticker. Sorry that took so long. And this is cool. Look at this. This is on green vinyl. Awesome. So that's really, really, really lovely. Really lovely. I'm glad about that. Nothing else inside. I thought maybe it might have had a sleeve or something to protect it. But anyway, I kind of cut the edge there by trying to get it open. Anyway, that was that one. So I was really, really happy to get that. Really excited. And they're really sticklers at my record store for Record Store Day. They only allow you one per customer. So you cannot ask for doubles or anything like that. Like last year when it was the uh, Penny Lane and Strawberry Fields one. Remember that? And it was so hard to get. I wanted to get two because a friend of mine couldn't get one in his town. So I was going to purchase one. But... I know the people at the record store, so I'm pretty good friends with them. So I asked him if I could get this one, because this one is also Paul McCartney Record Store Day. And the cool thing about this one is you're correct. It is on red. <laughs> Couldn't reach it. To where this one is green. So we got red and green for record store day. So that's really, really cool. Really cool. So red and green, record store day. That's really neat. And then I did not know this was out there until I was walking around the record store. But this was out as well. Have not seen this one, but this is the 12 inch. See, it's got a sticker there. Kind of cool. And there's your lineup. The vinyl sticker. So we opened up the plastic on this. All right. Ooh, cool. Always curious to see if there's something else. You know, it'd be really cool if they stuck in like a, like a Paul McCartney poster or something limited edition. Um... Yeah, limited edition of, the, of, of a poster. Oh, yes. Oh, so wait. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Oh, yeah. I'm really happy with that. Look at that. Look at that in red. Oh, yeah. So sweet. Excellent. Excellent. So, and also, this was not a record store day release, but I really wanted to get this. And these are... I, I'm not going to buy all of them. I just wanted one or two. And I'm still leaning towards maybe two, but I might not get any. <laughs> like I said, I'm just getting the one. But this I got for also the uh, Paul McCartney, Venus and Mars. And this is in the colored, see if you see here, it's got this type sticker. And this is during the colored series when they did these that just came out. And it's got all the posters and the stickers, the whole thing for Venus and Mars. And as I and as you saw in that, I'm looking at this just as you guys are. Oh, sweet. Sweet. This is one that I wanted because this was two colors. Look at that. Isn't that cool, everybody? Oh, man. I don't know if you're getting the uh, 
pop out colors like I am, but this is just, as I say, this is fab beetleless. Oh my gosh, look at that. Isn't that cool? Paul McCartney. This is the only one out of the whole series that's got a swirl. Well, not, no, it's not a swirl color. A red and yellow um, on each side. The rest of them are a solid red or a solid color. And I just basically wanted this one because of the swirl. I just thought that was cool. Um, so that's new. So if you're out at your local record store and you want to find something neat, you need to find that one. Drop my knife. Okay, this next one is Beatles. Why in the world am I showing this? Why in the world am I playing this? The reason I'm playing that is because today, well, I did get this. This is not record store day, but this is still in the wrap. Just now opening it. Today is Pete Best's birthday. So, happy birthday, Pete. And this is the album that I just got at my record store. There's the songs. And good old Pete Best, this is 2017, is 76 years old. So I had to throw that in there. So happy birthday, Mr. Pete. Mr. Pete Best. There we go. There's the record. That's really pretty cool. I didn't expect it to be on colored vinyl or anything like that, but it's just kind of cool. I like that. Okay, that was not a record store day. That was just something that Beetle Brad found in the new arrivals for Beatles stuff. And then next up is this one by the Turtles. And this is the Turtles 1966. And isn't that, look at that, look at the cover on that. Isn't that fantastic? I mean, that really looks like 1966, <laughs> which it is. But this is kind of like Lost Songs, stuff like that, the Turtles. That's really cool. Just really, really cool. Um, I love the picture on it. Really, really cool looking picture. So let's try not to cut my finger. Let's open this up. Open this up and I'll show this to you as well. I'm kind of excited to hear this. So this will be kind of fun. And here is the record for the Turtles. This was a great group in the 60s. Great, great group. And that was a record store exclusive. And that was kind of neat. Um, and this was a limited edition. They're saying this is a limited edition of a thousand. Eh, I don't know. It's, I think it's part of hype, I guess, maybe. But it's kind of like my dad would say. Um, you know, we print up a thousand of these. And when we're done printing a thousand and we run out of them, we go back and get another limited edition a thousand. <laughs> so my dad would say, um, so we'll get another thousand after that as well. So I don't know how limited it is. But that's kind of neat. But I thought I'd show you what I got at Record Store Day today. So it was awesome. It was fun. I had a good time. That's why I got my Paul McCartney shirt on because I was excited to get the Paul McCartney stuff. But I hope you enjoyed what I got. Um, did you go to Record Store Day? Let me know down below. I'm curious. Uh, did you guys get some stuff at the record store stores today and uh, vinyl? Or did you just enjoy watching my video and you didn't make it out? Um, but I just thought I'd show you what I got, some of the things. And it was exciting fun. Um, it was kind of funny. Like, let me back up to this morning again. Another quick story. I, I started up a conversation and talking to people while we're waiting in line. And I said, so what are you getting at record store day? And she's like... I'm not telling you because I don't want you to grab what I'm wanting. And I'm like, okay. You know, so I talked to the guy next to me. What are you getting? He goes, oh, I'm getting a few things, but I don't want you to grab what I'm getting. I said, no biggie. I said, I'm just in there to get Paul McCartney stuff. They said, oh, okay, well, we're getting this and we're getting this. So um, I started up a conversation. 
I know you watch my videos. I'm such a shy person. So I just ended up start talking. <laughs> but it was kind of fun. So nobody was after what I was getting. And the guy was next to me in line. I was trying to find the 45s of the Paul McCartney and all that kind of stuff. And he holds them up and he goes, hey, here you go. Here's your Paul McCartney 45s. I'm like, sweet. You know, he helped me out. So that was really nice. Really nice. But we had a good time. It was a lot of fun. But comment down below. Let me know what you thought I got. Was it good stuff or did I buy junk? <laughs> Don't say it was junk. Beetle Brad gets good Beetle stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Having fun with you. Joking around. All right, vinyl community. I have spent way too much time talking and showing. All right, vinyl community. Take care, everybody. Good to see you. Like I said in the beginning, good to see each and every one of you. Comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. And we'll talk later. All right, vinyl community? So as I say, I am out of here. Take care, vinyl community. See ya.